As we mentioned before, search and social media marketing are the two most common activities that people do online. And therefore, understanding those two activities gives you an insight of how the individuals might engage with your organization. However, there are a number of other touch points that the individual has with your organization that go beyond the digital remit. It might be in a physical store, it might be a leaflet, it might be a conversation in, in a restaurant with their friend that will be mentioning your name. So how do you control those? The reality is you can't. What you can do is you can just simply influence and try and engage with them on as many networks as you can in the most favorable way. So that means that if you are an organization then you are trying to uh, think about the customer journey, you will need to look at your website's traffic using a tool such as Google Analytics analytics that gives you an insight of what the most frequent social media networks that have brought the visitors to your site. Or you can look at the general industry analysis and there are tools such as Think with Google that shows you the typical online customer journey to, in, to online purchase in your area and those tools give you an insight into how organizations in your area usually interact with their visitors. For us, the type of content that we run on social media activity um, is perhaps more responsive, so it gauges that response a lot quicker um, because of the shares on uh, social media activity. Whereas on search, it seems to be that uh, with optimization, it's more of a longer term game in terms of you know, being recognized by Google and in the medium to long term, your activity generating large waves of traffic that come through. So we see, although the content and the messaging can be similar across search engine activity and social, that social is more engaging and has a quicker response and is more short term, whereas search, uh, search engine optimization would be more medium to long term uh, for attracting that traffic. I think that social media is a part of your off-page uh, optimization, so every link coming from your own media, or social media, in your site is helping your website. So yes, I think social is helping uh, the SEO. Uh, very important because uh, Google can identify uh, social media's major links and sources for your websites. Social media and search optimization have been crucial for our company in building relationships with our existing and prospective customers. In real life, how we cultivate our relationships is often the greatest determinant of the type of life we're going to live. Business is no different. Our real business is done when we interact with people and form long-term relationships with our clients. Social media has only helped us scale these interactions with current and potential customers to unprecedented levels. Therefore, it's absolutely crucial that small companies like ours use the right tools to develop these relationships with their client base in order to achieve market growth.